All right, guys, today we're doing a review. It's just more of a how to use the Rule Low Pro Bilge Pump. So I've got a little inflatable dinghy. Um, I just don't want to have water in the bottom of it. Inflatable is not going to sink. I don't care how much water you put in it. It's just going to stay above water. But I don't want a bunch of water on my feet, so I'm putting this in, a little battery. Um, so I'm going to go over all the things and how they're used all right i'll put this in the description as well just so you know all right so it fastens let's pull it out right here so you would make a plate for it to bolt to and bolt it down and that's how it would fasten and the l is up that means that it'll turn on in uh 1.3 inches or less of water if you want the h up that's at two inches of water that'll start that kind of defeats the purpose of the this one um now also there is a duckbill valve in here um it closes so that when the water pumps out it stops the water from coming back in with a little water pressure it just closes it so that the water stops going it won't go back in so it pulls all the water out and then holds it up here for us so let me show you just like that, but a little bit of pressure backwards, and it closes, and that stops the water from coming. And then more pressure going out, it opens up more, I can't really, but it opens up more with more pressure going out. So it stops the water from coming back in the boat, you know. Um, also, there's a timer on this, so if you were to slide this back it's like every three minutes i believe it kicks on or turns the sensor on every three minutes turns the sensor on and then kicks on something like that so it's a timer as well i'm going to be setting mine up low We've got different sizes for different size hoses it's all adjustable so you can turn this any way you want turn this any way you want so you can actually have this in any direction that you want. Like that. Now the wiring. The black wire is your ground. Goes straight to ground. The uh, brown with white is the automatic pump. And the straight brown is your positive switch. So it will automatically turn on when there's power to this. And then with the brown wire, it turns on when you flip the switch on. So you can manually turn it on or automatically turn it on. There's a few different setups that are in the directions as well um, for you. Um, this unscrews very easily. It's just threaded in there. So you can go from the bigger one to the littler one. Um, mine's just going to be a simple, simple setup in the, the bilge of an inflatable. So I'm just going to use a bit of garden hose. One of these guys. Let's see. Each one has, has its own. Um, on, on the end of this. And just, I'm going to have it slung over the side of the inflatable. No big deal at all. I'm going to uh, bolt this. The bottom of my inflatable has aluminum you know, aluminum boards that slide right into the bottom to give you a, a, a floor. I'm just going to bolt that to the end of one of the boards and, you know, that's going to be that's gonna be how that's set up in there. So that's that system. That'll keep your build really dry. It brings the water down to like less than a quarter of an inch of water, so it'll really suck out some water for you. All right, guys, that helped you in any way, shape, or form. Give me a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button. Um, this bilge pump will be in the description below, as well as this t-shirt. If you want me to wear some your business swag, please mail me some. I'll be more than happy to do some advertising. Peace.